Hey there, in this video you are going to learn how to crack password protected zip archives. This is a password protected zip archive. I don't know the password but I would love to see what's inside. Luckily there's a tool called John that can help us. John is a master at cracking passwords. Sadly John can only understand hash values so we need to translate our file into such a hash. John comes with a bunch of translation tools, each called x2john. In our case, we can use zip2john to generate a hash value and write the result into a file called hash. If we take a look at this file, we notice that we can close it again because there's no way we understand what's in it. Now that we have translated the archive, we can ask John to crack the password. There are two main ways that John can try to crack a password. The first is to just randomly guess the password with random characters until we get lucky. This may take a long time, depending on the hardware and the complexity of the password. The second way is to supply a list of potential passwords. This method will always be quicker if you have an idea on what the password could be. Let's go the route with the password list, maybe we get lucky. We call John, specify the password list we want to use and finally the file containing the hash. There we go, that's the password of the zip archive. Let's look inside. Well then, if that ain't a classic. Recap, we use zip to john to generate a hash value, then john to crack the password with the hash. If you do not have a password list, you can make john guess passwords by simply not specifying the word list value. Prepare to wait a long time until it's finished though. I hope this video helped you to get a better understanding of password cracking. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. Until next time, bye!